up to GDG on campus IMT tech crew this is Abhi Bhash Pratap Singh your GDG on campus IMT tech lead and today we are going to start with our lab 2 of module 2 so let's get started the lab code is given over here GSP 421 which you can simply search like you have done in your previous lab also click on start lab confirm that you are not a robot then launch the lab with one credit wait for a while till the lab is getting started okay the lab is started now simply click over here open the link in the new tab till then just go to task 1 copy api and services from here i understand So we have simply set up that cloud console. You have to copy this API and services from here. Then paste it over here. <laughs> Go on API and services. Then library. We have to search for this. Copy it. Simply go on here. Library. Okay. Search for the API check whether it is enabled or not in my case it is enabled so I don't have to enable it again now simply scroll down to here click on this link bucket insert now what we have to do ok from here just copy your GCP project ID Maximize this, try this method one. Okay, simply paste your project ID over here, then drag a little bit, paste your project ID over here again. Oh, I guess I wait for a minute. Yeah, paste your project ID over here simply check these two boxes then click on execute select your student id then scroll then again continue allow as you can see it is 200 means the codes are successfully executed now simply you have to add one after your project id in the name section here like i have done it and simply execute it once again done now you have to perform check progress for the two tasks you have done with the two tasks now simply close it now what we have to do we have to open the bucket like wait for a minute yeah in cloud storage you will see the bucket section click on the buckets here you can see the buckets will be created wait for a while the two buckets are already created click on the first bucket now you have opened the first bucket now what you have to do you have to upload two images first one is this one which is demo image one and this is demo image two so simply left click on the image and then save image as click on save image as okay what we have to do that simply remove this name and put the name demo image one over here and save this image simply 
and similar task you have to do for the image 2 also left click on the image save image as then again put here demo image image 2 and you have to save it again simply now you have to come again over here up click on upload upload files now simply search for the demo images which you have saved like this select both the images not all the folders just two images then click on open as you can see the uploading of the images has been started over here done okay we are done with the image uploadation part simply go here now scroll a little bit again check for your progress done now what we have to do we have to open this click on this link over here now bucket name the bucket name our project copy our project id wait for a while till it is getting set up okay source bucket will be our project id only then in destination bucket you have to press put your project id and then one in the last then source object will be our demo image one dot png or you can copy it from here also no worries with that also paste it in the destination of the object demo image one dash copy dot png simple scroll little bit you have to take these two boxes also then execute again select the student id done as you can see this lab is also this task is also completed by your, you now simply check your progress done guys we have complete successfully completed the lab 2 of the module 2 so congrats now you can simply end this lab from here and stay tuned for the upcoming labs and videos and please complete all your labs on time as you can see lab completed bye and take care Oh, 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 oh,